Stay one step ahead with Dubai Eye. I love cricket, as does the cricket mad population of the United Arab Emirates. Joining us in the studio is a businessman who wants to capitalize on that. He is Salman Sawar Butt. He's the chief executive of UAE T20X, a new T20 cricket tournament launching in the Emirates in about four months' time. Salman, good morning. Thanks for joining us. Good morning and uh, happy to be back. It's <laughs> lovely to see you. Great news. We had the news that you were launching T20X earlier on this month. Now we got uh, a little bit more detail. Yesterday you unveiled your global brand ambassador, A.B. de Villiers, the iconic South African cricketer. He's not going to be playing, but he's going to be promoting the, the T20X league. Here's my first question to you. There are already loads of T20 leagues in the world. The IPL in India, of course, is the daddy of them all. You've got the Big Bash in Australia, uh, the Pakistan Cricket League, which plays here as well. Why do we need another one. Where's the gap in the market, Salman? Okay, uh, first of all, uh, this is a UAE T20X event. It's a it's a league for the UAE. It's UAE's own league and it's a truly global league. Um, and I'll explain that to you because that's the differentiating factor. Um, UAE is, an, is a destination, is an international destination for the rest of the world to come in. Um, this league actually represents uh, not just the UAE itself, it represents more than 20 cricket-playing nations uh, in the world. And that's one of the key differences uh, amongst this league and anyone, any other league. The other thing is that this league is being built uh, as a top-quality international league, as well as um, having in it a truly global development agenda. So this league offers to the rest of the world a development agenda where young players as can come and play alongside top quality international players and showcase their skills and go back to their home countries and play for their home countries or play for the UAE. What are you going to do to fill the stadiums here? Because you need the crowds, even for the television audiences, you need the crowds to give it that atmosphere and that buzz. Mm. And we've had all sides of the spectrum here in the UAE. I've mm. been to cricket matches here where it was packed, where it was sold out. The Indian Premier League, when it was here, was a huge success. The Pakistan Super League has been here, got a lot of following. Mm. I've also been to cricket matches where it was me, the groundsman, and somebody selling Pepsi, and that was about it, and all points in between. You, you have long experience in cricket. You're a career banker, but you've worked on the Pakistan Super League. You've worked with the, the Pakistan Cricket Board, so you're no stranger mm. to the business of cricket. What's the difference between me and the janitor and, and a sold-out stadium? Okay, very very good question. First of all, you have to have a strong product to to pull, pull people towards, uh, towards it. Um, the The... Uh, T20X is a top quality international event. It will showcase top top uh, 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 players from around the world. That's you know that's core. It will have uh, coaches, mentors, etc. That are top quality from around the world. Then you have to build the brand and engage it with the rest of the. Uh, community here in the in the UAE, and that's what we have the opportunity to do. Unlike maybe any other league that comes here and plays and then goes back, so we are going to be building this league a couple of months before, and you already see the build build up taking place with AB De Villiers announced. We will be announcing the icons going forward.